Hello. I'm in a ghost town. Ghost city, Sanya. So from my last video, you saw that uh, I got yellow coded on Wednesday. And that's when sort of things, the shit hit the pan, as we say. Uh, got yellow coded by error because the app thought I went to a different area in Hainan, which I didn't go to. Anyway, I had to sleep in a car. The family were lucky to stay in a hotel because they didn't get yellow coded. So I slept in a car that night, tested again, did two 40 hour tests, got got a contact with the government guy. He changed my code back to green. All good. Yeah, Wednesday, this is when. No, this is Thursday, after me sleeping in a car. Thursday, we found a nice hotel called Primus or Primus Hotel. Get to the hotel. We noticed half the building had been closed off. And we asked the security guards why, and they said, these people have red codes and they've been put in this hotel for quarantine. So we were like, right, we're not booking into, we, we want our money back for this hotel because obviously we're not gonna stay there. Then we find a hotel that we stayed in before called the Wingate. Nice pool, nice breakfast, blah, blah, blah. Nice rooms. We go back, as we're going back to that hotel, we hear the news that things are starting to get worse in Sanya and that, you know, areas are starting to be closed down. Eventually, now it's Sunday and all flights got canceled yesterday from the airport and we have to stay here in this area for seven days and do seven days of continuous testing. No shops open, nothing is open, no cars, no deliveries, no DD, nothing. Just the hotel, pool's closed. Uh, Buffet breakfast closed today for the last time. So tomorrow we'll get breakfast delivered to our room. We came to Sanya to escape the virus in Chengdu. And now there are thousands and thousands of people stuck in Sanya. Now on the 13th, after the seven days, the flights will reopen. But everyone's flight got canceled and the airlines, in their wisdom, didn't reschedule those flights. 99% they have given refunds and you cannot reschedule. So we've tried to book flights on the 13th and they are just astronomical. And many of them have no baggage allowance. So it's just a nightmare. So we... We know we've got to do the seven days, that's fair enough. But we don't know how, when we're going to be able to leave Sanya. So yeah, it's a nightmare. And yesterday the government announced that all the hotels have to give you half price of your original booking. So when we checked in on Thursday, it was a normal price. So we get that now, we get that price at 50% off, which is good. But a lot of the hotels where people had to come back from the airport yesterday have upped their prices. They've doubled their prices. So those poor travelers are still paying the same price. They're not getting that discounted price. So it's just a nightmare. Luckily, I can walk out of my hotel, but as you can see, 
There's no one around. Someone's playing music there. So yeah, the nightmare continues. Uh, there's a lot of news about it on Twitter, etc. But I haven't seen anything on YouTube. So yeah, keep you updated. Don't come to Sanya. <laughs>